Hi, I'm Shane with Salamander Paddle Gear and I'm here to tell you a few tricks about putting together your new bike trailer. First thing is we've switched the way we clip these off, the axle off on the wheel. We used to just use a pin but some people were catching it on things and pulling them off. So now what we're doing is if you'll notice when you pour out your, your bag of parts, there's two larger washers and two key rings. This larger washer goes on and the key ring goes over that on each side. Another thing we've been asked a lot about is what's the tape for? Well the tape's for taking up any slop or if your joints are making any creaking you can simply wrap tape around this and then put it into the cradle and that will help take up any type of rattles. The next thing I want to talk about is the connection between the bike frame and the seat post clamp. This part right here goes into the bike frame and then you bolt it through and you have to add the swivel. This used to be done already but now you have to do it. And the best way to put this swivel in is to turn it all the way in and then back it off two or three turns. You want, you want this swivel to be able to rotate all the way around. On occasion you may hit a curb or something that bounces the trailer over and you want that swivel to be able to absorb all that energy. So make sure you have two or three turns or rows of thread at the end so the swivel can rotate freely. Okay, the final thing I want to make sure everyone knows is that when you put this seat post clamp onto your seat post that these tanges are facing up. If you have the tanges facing down and you hit something hard with the trailer, all that energy goes right into this top flange and if it's enough energy it can break. We have reinforced these flanges so they're very strong but if you put it in right side with the flanges pointing up and then the trailer coming into it you won't have any problems. And final, every time you load or unload your bike trailer always take the trailer off the bike. Just pull this pin out Take the trailer, set it on the ground, load your, your board or boat, strap it up, get it all ready to go, put it back on the bike, pin it in, and then get on your bike and go. When you get to where you're going, get off your bike, pull the pin, set the trailer on the ground. That will help make this trailer last for a very long time.